Hi friends! Welcome, welcome! Today's video is a detailed tutorial on embroidering super easy and adorable amigurumi faces. I'm providing the four diagrams right here so you can refer to it at any time. One box represents one stitch. At the end of the video, I'll be showing you a way to secure the yarn seamlessly. I'll be providing timestamps so you can jump to each section of the facial expressions easily. It may be faster to use safety eyes on your amigurumi plushie, but embroidery is a safer option for babies because safety eyes can pose a choking hazard. Although it actually takes me longer sometimes and it hurts my fingers when trying to secure the back of those safety eyes. I might need to invest in a tool to make that process easier. If you know a good tool, please recommend it to me in the comments below. Without further ado, let's get started. Welcome to the first Amigurumi face embroidery tutorial. Let's start by marking the location of the stitches based on the diagram on the left hand side. You can use pin needles or stitch markers here. This step is important as you may choose to adjust the size and gap of your embroidery to suit the toy you are making. To make it easier for you to see the pin's location, I will have a red circle mark in the diagram each time I place the pins. I ran out of pins here, so I'm going to use my other needle. That's all the eyes and mouth marked. Let's start embroidering. Using the black yarn, I'm going to start from the inner right eye. Check out the diagram. I will highlight the red circle while inserting the needle in the hole for the first time. Thank you. 
Pull gently here and ensure your yarn is above the loop shape. Insert the needle back at that same hole to secure the yarn and exit at the very first inner right eye spot. We finished the eye and mouth, let's now do the cheek embroidery. With my white yarn, I'm starting from the inner right cheek. Make sure to exit this last stitch at the very first inner right cheek spot. We now finish with all the stitching of the first face embroidery tutorial. The finishing technique on how to seamlessly hide all the yarn is located at the end of this video. You can go there by clicking the timestamp below. Leave a blue heart emoji in the comments if you find this tutorial helpful. Thanks friends! Welcome to the second Amigurumi face embroidery tutorial. Let's start by marking the location of the stitches based on the diagram on the left hand side. You can use pin needles or stitch markers here. This step is important as you may choose to adjust the size and gap of your embroidery to suit the toy you are making. To make it easier for you to see the pin's location, I will have a red circle mark in the diagram each time I place the pins.
That's all the eyes marked. Let's start embroidering. Using the black yarn, I'm going to start from the inner right eye. Check out the diagram. I will highlight the red circle while inserting the needle in the hole for the first time. For the eyeball, we will begin by creating a square border. I'm just looping the thread above this loop. Once the border is done, we are going to start filling it with four cross stitches. Cross stitch looks like X shape. I'm just looping the thread above this loop. I'm just looping the thread above this loop. I'm just looping the thread
Once you are done, we are now just going to go back and forth a little bit more to fill any visible gap. When all gap is filled, this step is optional but I like to do a straight line from the top middle to the bottom middle to create an eye line in the center of the iris like this. To finish the right eye, ensure to exit the last stitch at the same inner right eye spot. Always exit your last stitch at the same spot as the first stitch. Now the right eye is finished, let's move on to the left eye. We are one stitch away from finishing the left eye. I'm going to stop marking the mouth with the pins now.
Pull gently. Ensure the yarn is below the loop shape. Insert the needle back at the same spot. This will secure the loop. Remember to exit the last stitch at the exact same hole as the first stitch in the left eye. Moving on to the cheek embroidery. With my white yarn, I'm starting from the inner right cheek. Make sure to exit this last stitch at the very first inner right cheek spot. We now finish with all the stitching. The finishing technique on how to seamlessly hide all the yarn is located at the end of this video. You can go there by clicking the timestamp below. Leave me a red heart emoji in the comments if you find this tutorial helpful. Thanks friends! Welcome to the third Amigurumi face embroidery tutorial. Let's start by marking the location of the stitches based on the diagram on the left hand side. You can use pin needles or stitch markers here. This step is important as you may choose to adjust the size and gap of your embroidery to suit the toy you are making. To make it easier for you to see the pin's location, I will have a red circle mark in the diagram each time I place the pins. That's all the eyes marked. I ran out of pins here. Let's start embroidering. 
Using the black yarn, I'm going to start from the inner right eye. Check out the diagram. I will highlight the red circle while inserting the needle in the hole for the first time. Pull gently, ensure the yarn is below the loop shape. Insert the needle back at the same spot. This will secure the loop. When you pull the yarn tight, it will create a straight line as opposed to curved line. So if you want your eye line to be curved, don't pull the yarn too tightly here and keep a looser tension. Pull gently, ensure the yarn is below the loop shape. Insert the needle back at the same spot. This will secure the loop.
insert the needle back at that same hole to secure the yarn and exit at the very first inner right eye spot. We finished the eye and mouth, let's now do the cheek embroidery. With my white yarn, I'm starting from the inner right cheek. I'm just going over the stitch one more time to create a thicker cheek line. Make sure to exit this last stitch at the very first inner right cheek spot. We now finish with all the stitching. The finishing technique on how to seamlessly hide all the yarn is located at the end of this video. You can go there by clicking the timestamp below. Leave a yellow heart emoji in the comments if you find this tutorial helpful. Thanks friends! Welcome to the fourth Amigurumi face embroidery tutorial. Let's start by marking the location of the stitches based on the diagram on the left hand side. You can use pin needles or stitch markers here. This step is important as you may choose to adjust the size and gap of your embroidery to suit the toy you are making. To make it easier for you to see the pin's location, I will have a red circle mark in the diagram each time I place the pins. That's all the eyes marked, let's start embroidering. Using the black yarn, I'm going to start from the inner right eye. Check out the diagram. I will highlight the red circle while inserting the needle in the hole for the first time.
Pull gently here and ensure your yarn is above the loop shape. Insert the needle back at that same hole to secure the yarn. Insert the needle back at that same hole to secure the yarn. I'm just looping the thread
insert the needle back at that same hole to secure the yarn and exit at the very first inner right eye spot. We finished the eye and mouth, let's now do the cheek embroidery. With my white yarn, I'm starting from the inner right cheek. Make sure to exit this last stitch at the very first inner right cheek spot. We now finish with all the stitching. Leave a green heart emoji in the comments below if you find this tutorial helpful. Thanks friends! Welcome to the making up process tutorial. Now we are going to secure all the ends and hide the remaining yarn seamlessly. This method applies for all the embroidery. Please make sure that our final yarn is at the same location as the first yarn. Tie a couple of knots. Using our yarn needle, Thread through both yarn and insert the needle in that same hole. Exit anywhere. Cut any remaining long yarn and using the back of our needle, push the remaining yarn back inside the body. As you can see, the yarn will no longer be visible. 
Repeat this process until all the remaining yarn is hidden. This face embroidery tutorial is based on my recent Amigurumi Blocks free crochet pattern. So if you like cute, small and easy things that you can whip up pretty quickly, check out these video tutorials.